Hello students, our today's topic is a distance and displacement. Distance and displacement are two similar words used distinctly with the different meanings. Like for example, laugh and smile. In the motion of an object, distance and displacement are the major of path length. But why distance and displacement are two different terms used to measure path length? To understand this, let's take an example. A boy moves from A to D, 3 meter, and from D to C, one meter. Total path cover is equal to three plus one equal to four meter. But the boy is at C, two meter away from A. Which is the correct path length? To find the answer, let's define distance. Distance is the length of actual path cover by an object. In the example, a boy moved from A to D 3 meter and from D to C 1 meter. Distance covered by the boy is equal to total path cover which is equal to 3 plus 1 equals to 4 meter. Distance gives complete information about the path traveled by the object. It is unable to explain how far out of the place the object is. To answer this question, the term displacement is used. Displacement. The shortest distance between the initial point and the final point is covered by an object. Reconsider the example. A boy moved from A to D 3 meter and from D to C 1 meter. Displacement of the boy is equal to distance between the initial point and the final point. A is the initial point. C is the final point. Distance between them is AC, which is equal to 2 meter. Displacement is unable to give actual path cover by the object between the initial point and the final point. Therefore, the term distance is used. Back to our original question. Why distance and displacement are two different terms used to measure path length? Here is the answer. Distance is the actual path cover by the object. Displacement is how far out of the place the object is. Hope you understand the concept. Thank you.